Hi, my name's Liz Pichon and I write and draw all the Tom Gates books and of which there are 18 of them all together. But this year is a very special year because it will be 10 years since the very first Tom Gates came out, was published. Um, that's called The Brilliant World of Tom Gates. I've got a new book coming out in February called Tom Gates' 10 Tremendous Tales. Um, and part of the celebration, I'm going to be reading to you a little bit of every single one of the books that I've written. And um, right now I'm going to read a little bit from Apps. Tom Gates is absolutely fantastic at some things. I thought I'd read to you the bit which included the banana doodle as it's on the front cover as well. I don't know if any of you have tried doing a banana doodle, but um, it's very simple to do. You get a real banana and show you there, look, you poke little holes in the skin. Be very careful if you're using sharp, something sharp. Don't go all the way into it. You just do tiny little things in the skin and where you've made the skin, uh, where you break the skin, it turns black. So you can do a little doodle on it. So you could try that at home. So this is Tom in class and he's having a go at a banana doodle. While I'm waiting for my picture to dry, I take the cocktail sticks out of the banana and think about eating it. That's when I notice that the banana skin has turned black where the cocktail sticks went in. I gently poke one of the sticks into the skin again and it starts to turn black almost immediately, or almost straight away. Okay, this could be good. So I do a few more dots and start to build up a doodle. <clears throat> Amy wonders what I'm doing, so I show her. Oh, that's amazing, she says. It's good, isn't it? I do another banana doodle on the fresh side. Guess who? So who's that then? Amy is very impressed and thinks it's funny. And Marcus, who's being nosy, is looking at it too. Hmm, what's that? A banana doodle. Let's have a look, he says. Marcus wants to know how I did it. So I say, it's easy, I'll show you. Dot, dot. Dot, 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 There you go. That's how you do it. Marcus is studying the banana closely and the dots get darker and he says, Oh, OK, I get it now. Is that Mrs Worthington? So I say, keep your voice down, Marcus. I don't want Mrs Worthington to see it. Hmm, see what, Tom? Too late, Mrs Worthington says. Very creative, Tom. You've done a dot-to-dot -dot drawing on a banana. I have. And that looks a bit like me. Uh-oh, I'm in trouble now. I'm guessing Mrs Worthington has just seen the extra moustache dots. Stay behind after class, Tom. Could have been worse, I suppose. So there you go. <laughs> so that's... What happened was um, Tom did a picture of Mrs Worthington and he also added a little bit of moustache there. So he gets to have to clean up after school. It always seems a bit harsh, actually. I probably get Tom to do far more home. Um, he has far more sort of detentions than most kids would normally do. <laughs> but there you go. That's from Tom Gates is absolutely fantastic at some things, including banana doodles. Bye.